fitting room. Mountain lion versus a ram. What's going on guys? It's Eli, back with another vlog. And one take, yes, another one of these vlogs, one take. And if you guys remember, um, cause well, cause I did a vlog of us here at Cabela's and we're back. We're back at Cabela's. Could you not tell when this video started? But what I was saying was, if you guys remember, cause I had the last time we were here at Cabela's, it was in the vlog I did of me, Little Blue, and IG Illusional. We were at one of our local malls. We were also at Sky Zone, but cut to one day later, and me and Little Blue, we were here at Cabela's. If you want to go see that vlog, links in the description below. Here are some of the animals right here. They sure have uh, changed uh, positions for these animals. Like, check out that grizzly bear right there. And that polar bear. And those, uh, what are those? Musk ox. Some type of buffalo, in the buffalo kind of animal, I don't know. Oh well. I don't know. I really don't know. That was a little blue you just saw. Possibly the thumbnail? I don't know. If not, I can make it the thumbnail. I mean, who knows? Well, it depends when, when I upload this. It depends on what type of thumbnail you're going to be seeing, and if I like it or not, or if I'm going to change it. Or if I'm going to do what I just did, make that the thumbnail where I'm looking up and there's the mountain lion. <sighs> so, <laughs> here's some steaks right here. Has some turkeys and some ducks. Aw, oh, man. Once again, we're here. The cafe is not open. Oh, that sucks. Okay, we'll see. Uh, operating hours. Seven days a week from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay. So, if we're ever here, you know, we would if we're surprisingly here, and if it's open, we might get a snack or something, snack something at the bar, cafe, or just... If sure you, I'm sure you get what I'm trying to say. Oh, yeah. Anyways, but also, in the uh, title of this vlog, not just doing Cabela's and doing McDonald's, because, yeah, that's all, we're also doing McDonald's. Uh, <laughs> Anyways, not just doing Cabela's or McDonald's, but also going to be talking about a few things that popped in my head, well, that I want to talk about. First off, first off, let's talk about the the next convention, because after doing Tricon, and which was the last vlog you saw, links in the description below if you want to see that vlog, the vlog at Tricon. The next convention we're going to be going to, uh, and pro hopefully it's going to be both, all three of us, meaning me, Little Blue, and IG Original. There's a raccoon. There's a mountain lion right there. The next convention, oops, the next convention coming up is going to be Charcon, which is at the Clay Center. And yeah, that's going to be, looks really interesting because at the Clay Center. Um, another thing is that, um, hmm, what was I going to say? Oh, well, there's another mountain lion right there up in the trees. You can barely see them because of the branches. But, uh, yeah. So, Charcon. That's going to be next month. Uh, I am planning to go as, actually, Spider-Man. Now, I'm sure some of you are like, well, wait a minute. You went as Cad Bane. You know, why are you going to go as Spider-Man this time? Well, that's because I'm going to go... I'm going to be doing... Okay, I did Cad Bane last time. I did, I did Cad Bane in the, the last convention we did. And now this time I'm going to go as Spider-Man and then go back and forth. You know, do Cad Bane after Spider-Man, do Cad Bane, one after the other, after the other. I'm sure you guys get what I'm saying, but, you know. By the way, here's a little blue. I just passed by him as I was talking, but what did you find? Uh, I found these shirts. Yeah, I was about to say you got two shirts. For $9.97 You got two each. shirts. And what, yeah, I mean, nine, and, look at these things, man. $9.97 each. That is cool. That yeah, is they're cool. nice. They're really nice. Really nice shirts. That is cool, yeah. 
Absolutely. So, yeah. And Little Blue, anything to say on the next convention coming up, which is Charcon? Uh, you know what? I think it'll be a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to it. And I also mentioned because I'll be going to Spider-Man. Yes, you will yes. be going to Spider-Man. And you found two Spider-Man costumes. You know, you found two. One, I assume, is the, I can tell which is the Tobey Maguire and the one that's Iron Spider. Correct. Which one do you think would do well? I don't know. I, I think uh, regular. I, I think the... Uh, well, it wasn't the Tobey Maguire. It was, it was actually the regular one from... Uh, I think it was the regular one that was in, you know, from, you know, uh, Homecoming. Yeah, so I'm so pretty I sure I don't... With, uh, I would say go with that one. I mean, that's just my... Yeah, I mean, what about you guys? You let us know in the comments which, which, co which costume you think would work. I doubt it's the one from Homecoming. It's clearly the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man suit. But you let, me, you let me know. That one or the Iron Spider in suit? Now, a little, I uh, mean, because... You know, because with Spider-Man Far From Home coming out, it's like Peter Parker's going to go back and forth with wearing Spider-Man suits. He's going to wear his regular, he's going to wear the Iron Spider suit, and he's also going to wear like a spy kind of gear spider suit. It's all in black, you know? That's basically what it is. It's all like a spy kind of uh, Spider-Man suit in spy gear. Uh, but anyways. So... Look around a little bit some more, and then we'll be heading to McDonald's. We might stop by and look look around quickly at Toys R Us. And what I mean by that is because, even, okay, yeah, it is closed, but I'm just saying, look around, you know, the building or something. I mean, I don't know. We'll see what we can do. Anyways, so, with Charcon, because that's coming up next month, I am definitely looking forward to that, and dressing up as Spider-Man... I bet you, though, when I dress up as Spider-Man, kind of like what happened when I dressed up when when I dressed up a, when I dressed up as Cad Bane, and when IG Illusion was dressed up as Kylo Ren, we got spotted and we got noticed, and everybody wanted our picture taken. And probably it'll be the same thing when I dress up as Spider-Man. I guarantee you that's what's going to happen. But guys, you let me know once again. Let us know in the comments section down below which Spider-Man suit would fit well for me would go would go well for me the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man suit or the Iron Spider suit let us know let us know in the comment section down below but anyways with all that okay with that set aside let's talk about Thomas and the Magic Railroad and I know what you're thinking why do you bring up Thomas the Magic Railroad well this is also because it has to do with me in Wizzo Lightred's Thomas and the Magic Railroad if you guys remember, because I've done a couple of videos. I gave Wizzo Lytra a shout-out, and I gave a promo. I did a promo. I did a video promoting his Thomas and the Magic Railroad director's cut fan dub film. That's basically what it is. And, of course, you guys saw the video because of my C. Jr. lines for uh, his Thomas and the Magic Railroad director's cut fan dub film. So, basically... Um, I am still looking forward to when that comes out. And Wizzo Lightroom, if you're listening, if you're watching this, I just want to say I'm, I'm yeah, I'm basically giving you another shout out. Man, I've been giving you, I think I'm. This is the third. This is the third shout out I'm giving to you. Well, technically, with the promo, me promoting your Thomas and the Magic Railroad director's cut, I guess that was technically me giving you a shout out. Even I mentioned it kind of was, but you know, it was just. Me, but I was promoting. I was promoting your Thomas and the Magic Railroad director's cut. Okay, but. Um, I just want to say, I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait to see how it turns out. Um, it's just, yeah, because I'm like, how are you going to do this? Like, you know, like, you, are you going to take, are you going to use, like, clips from, uh, like, say, the Ma Thomas and Magic Railroad? And how are you going to do PT Boomer? Are you going to use clips from Thomas and Friends at CG? I don't know. I mean, these kind of questions, just, I don't know. But I'd be up for doing another one of these fan dub uh, films with you. I suggest we should, I think... It would be awesome if we do like if there be like if we do like a Clone Wars movie fan dub film. I of course talk about the Clone Wars movie because from what I can tell, you like Star Wars, I like Star Wars, and I guess Clone Wars. But you let me know. I'm just I'm not saying I'm not I'm just giving us I'm just giving us I'm just giving a suggestion. I'm just like oh why don't we do this you know? <sighs> but anyways. But with Thomas the Magic, Thomas and the Magic Railroad, 
Um, I think I did pretty good on doing C Juniors, uh, doing the voice of C Junior. I did my best. I mean, I think I did. A, I pulled off a pretty good Scottish voice. Even as I mentioned in the Wizzle Lightridge shout out, because I can do a pretty good Scottish voice, whether it be like a character like Shrek or something like that, you know. Ogres are like onions. There you go. Well, that's the best I can do right now. I need to get into the character of Shrek, that is. Well, let's go find Little Blue and we'll... Okay. There he is over there. Oh. He's on... He's texting right now using the speaker. Or, no. Oh, he's on call. Okay. Hey, Little Blue. Look. Is IG Illusional on the phone? <laughs> I'm gonna try to see if I can get that to happen. Have IG Illusion make a quick cameo appearance. Hey, Little Blue. Little Blue. Is it possible? Little Blue, I'm talking to you. Good, good God. He can't even, like... Little Blue, we're following you. Little Blue. Hey. Little Blue. We want to say hi to IG Illusion on the phone. Come on, get him on the phone. Oh, God. What? I was clearly talking to you. Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were saying. I was something. saying little blue. I was clearly saying your name. Yeah, but I thought you were, to... I thought you were talking about me on. I was trying. I was also trying to say we should get IG Illusional on the phone, like for him to make a quick cameo appearance. On oh, here. he was. He's with. The, he's. He's with Tiger. He's. And. Uh... He's with his cat. Yeah, he's with his cat. Okay. All right. Well, see, I was trying to get your attention because I wanted to see if I can get I for you to put IG Illusional on the phone for him to make a quick cameo saying, hey, you know. Yeah, all right. Anyways. So, are we almost about done here? Yeah, we are almost about done here. I'm gonna... Okay, because I'd like to get moving to McDonald's, I know. Yeah. And for this vlog, so. Check out this, guys. A uh, Cabela's hat and a Cabela's coffee mug. Yeah. So, anyways. All right, let's look around one more, then I'll meet you there. Well, that kind of sucks, because I wanted to get IG Illusional on, on here. At, well, on FaceTime, that is. For him making a quick cameo. And that's the thing, because I, I... Maybe... Maybe... I didn't do this with the last convention, Tricon. Maybe with Char Charcon, I might do a one-take vlog. And then after that, and after that vlog, the next vlog you'd be seeing would be the vlog of us at Charcon. In other words, you know, the vlogs you had been seeing... Uh, you know, with editing and jump cuts and such. You know, those vlogs. And that's the thing, because with, with those vlogs, if you guys haven't been noticing, with those vlogs, you know, that you've been seeing, you know, editing and jump cuts, you know, the thumbnails of those vlogs, I put pictures on them. I put screenshots or photos in, 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 in for the thumbnails of those vlogs. So that way, you got, to let you guys know, so you know that those are the vlogs, those are the vlogs where were with editing and with jump cuts, you know, but with vlogs like these and how the thumbnails look, you know, those thumbnails, they don't have any, they don't have like pictures or anything like that on them. Just one, one picture of the thumbnail. So that's a way to let you guys know what types of vlogs you're seeing and what you'll be watching. So, you know, and basically with this vlog, it's in one take. So there you go. Now, okay, like the vlog I did of me at Target and I was seeing Captain Marvel twice. Okay, that, you know, that, um, that was just something I wanted to do for just having fun with, you know. I, that's, that's just something I wanted to do, so, you know. <sighs> but anyways, so. Battery's getting low, and I'd like to get out of here. Hey, little blue. Hey, what? We gonna get going? Cause I'd like to get moving to McDonald's, and my phone's gonna be close to dying. So. Yep. Let's go. All right, let's go now. So, let's make it quick. Actually, you know what? You go ahead and hand me the keys. I'll make my way to the car. All right. Cause we run out to walk out the door with him. <laughs> yeah. All right. You See you out there. One last look at Cabela's, and now let's get moving. Now let's get moving to the car. A guy back there uh, I was talking to. Okay, let's get let's get to the car fast because I want to plug my phone in. Oh, I meant 
I was over here. We were over here. There's our car. Okay. Let's get to the car and let's plug up my phone and we'll be good to go. Woo! Okay. I know where the, uh, okay. Hold the phone, guys. Uh-oh. Having trouble here. I'm trying to, hold on. I'll set this up for ya. That's better. That's good. All right. There we go. All right. Now my plow. No, now my phone's plugged in. That's more like it. That's good enough. So, anyways, so. Oh yeah, still got this back here because it's still been in the car since Tricon, the Kylo Ren mask. And this is the this is the one that IG Illusional did wear when we went to Tricon. And as you saw in the vlog, as well as the two videos that you saw were Kylo Ren versus Ray, and and the one with of course with me, <laughs> Cad Bane loses to Ray and Kylo Ren surrenders. That was funny what he did there. He just put his lightsaber down and I surrender. That was hilarious. Actually, it was very it was quite popular with you guys. You seemed to enjoy that one. Yeah. But, um, but I will admit, because Tricon was really fun. It really was. We had an excellent time. Uh, just nice people down there. Um, going up on stage, yeah, because as you saw, I'm, I apologize. First off, I want to say I apologize. Well, let me go and take this down. And, um, I just want to say, because I kind of apologize, because I don't know why Little Blue shot it. He got, he's gotten so used to, like, like, filming, like, portrait, you know, like this, but, you know, got, I mean, you know, people like me, we always, we always film landscape, so, you know, but, yeah, I don't know if you could see him, I'm trying to aim for him, yeah, here he comes, that's a little blue coming, he's, he's texting right now, I guess, anyways, so, he filmed it, like, the, that shot where I went up on stage as Cat Bane, it was film, it wasn't filmed landscape or anything, so I apologize for that, but that's the best you're gonna get. Boy, it's over it was electronic. Alright, so, he's on the phone right now, so, anyways, so, um, I just put the, yeah, cause he already, did he get, he got the shirts, didn't he? Yeah, 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 cause I see, yeah, I see two bags, so, you know. Anyways, so, um, so again, Tricon, like, as you saw in the video, like, cause, um, they had some, uh, cause the mystery, they had the mystery machine was there. There was also, um, there was also a bit of, uh, Mandalorian stuff there. And that was really cool. It looks so real. Like, like some of the armored parts, body parts, you know, and uh, the helmets and the guns. But they were made by those people that we were talking to, actually. Um, just amazing. We got to, we got, me, both me and Little Blue, both me and Little Blue got to hold one of those guns. <clears throat> it was really cool. So, and uh, some of the costumes there, like, um, and as you saw in the vlog, like, there was Poison Ivy. Oh, man. That poison ivy looks so good. Looks so good. I took I took a selfie with her. It's just so good. Um, Hell girl, because as you saw in that video, because of the costume contest, you could see that Hell girl was one of the winners, as well as one dressed up as as him from Powerpuff Girls, and dead Bonnie and Clyde, which that was really cool. Um, the uh there was uh the halo characters like there were two dressed up as halo and they won they won part of the costume contest and uh i don't know if you saw in the if you i don't know if you saw it in the vlog or not it, it, or not but uh even ig illusional got a picture with it there was somebody dressed up as uh as Sh as master chief master chief if i'm chef or chief it's master chief but the funny thing was master chief was a chef, like had a chef hat and I think a spatula, etc., etc., etc. Just hilarious, hilarious. 
Let's turn up the air conditioning. Whew. But anyways. Um, but yeah. And I'm looking forward to Charcon. And I can't wait for you guys to see the vlog I'm going to be doing of Charcon. And as I said back inside of Cabela's, I might do a one-take vlog. And then the next vlog you'll be seeing will be, um, will be, you know, the vlogs you've been seeing, editing, jump cuts, you know, that stuff. You'll be seeing that next. I mean, I'm gonna, it's up to me. I'll decide. So, you know. So anyway, so, oh, wait a minute. There's on the phone, so. Uh, I'll get you out of the way. Wanted to get off the phone. Wanted to get out of your way, so I didn't want to interrupt. So, you know. Anyway, so, uh, so you did get the shirts, did you? I did get the shirts. Okay, because I saw the two bags there, so you know. Anyway, so now on our way to McDonald's. Mm -hmm. So, now we, I guess we can drive around quickly at looking at Toys R Us, so you know. That way we can do, so that's what we can do. But anyways, uh, so. And I will say, you had fun at uh, Tricon, didn't you? I had fun, yes I did. Yeah, and... Those two, though, because we took video of that, and you took videos, because the parts with Ray versus Kylo Ren, that was good, mm -hmm. and and the one where I where I was dressed up as Cad Bane, I lost to Rain then, remember, because Kylo Ren like put his lightsaber down, and he surrendered. That was hilarious, wasn't it? That was. Yeah, and that was, and you guys seemed to enjoy that the most. I mean, I was hoping because I. I mean, technically did, like, that would explode, those two would explode, and they technically did. In other words, like, they explode, like, oh, like, be, like, oh, this is so cool, like, you know, it'd get a lot of good views or something like that, and it kind of did, but, you know. And don't give it time, though, they will. Hashtag, because I put hashtags in them, so. Anyways, so now we are on the road, okay, gonna get a quick look at Toys R Us. And then we're gonna be going to oh, McDonald's. So, anyways, so that's what we're doing. See, and you got those two shirts, obviously, that you showed on. Yes, I did. Yeah, I think they go well. With, I think they might go well with you. Mm -hmm. Yes, I yes. Definitely. Oh, not only that, but there's wait. What kind of restaurant is that again? Bojangles is uh, out of it's it's out of the south. It's a it's a chain from out from down south. It's uh, chicken and stuff like that. Uh huh. Okay. Went for this person to pass by. Okay. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should give that place a try. Bojangles, if the food's good or not. Oh uh, wait, Toys R Us. We're gonna grab a quick look at that. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Uh, okay. Uh, Chuck E. Cheese. Chuck E. Cheese is. We will plan to go back there sometime. And there's Toys R Us. Like, look at that. No cars, nothing. And just, oh, it's a, it's, a, it's hard to imagine. It's heartbreaking. It is. I mean, look. They still got those out. They still got the uh, shopping cart things there. Well, when you put the shopping carts out, that's just, oh, man. And it was, didn't, we heard this. Like, there was, like, there was something, it was, it was even on the news, like, that, there was a there was a slight sh there was a slight chance that Toys R Us was coming back. Don't you remember hearing about that? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Now that restaurant right there, we've eaten there before, and the food's okay, don't you think? Uh, I'm not crazy about it. It gets um, I get you. The first couple of times I ate there was okay, and then it just got um, it just got old. And I, mm. I guess because I ate at um, I ate at uh, one in. In Pittsburgh, a couple times, and it just was not any good. No, it wasn't. But oh well. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> I mean, we should get, we we could at least give that place another try sometime. Yeah, we will sometime. I'm just kind of letting it, you know. Huh. They even have a pickup window. So. Yeah, I didn't even notice that. You did. You now notice that? I didn't notice that. But you now did. I just now did. Yeah. Uh, I got to go back in here for just a minute. Alrighty. I'll try to keep the viewers entertained before we get to McDonald's. So keep the viewers entertained. Yes. I mean, I am. I'm starting now. Starting to get about hungry. So you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, but anyways, going back in for something. Yeah, going back in just to check on something, and I'll be right back. No problem. No problem. You do that. So. <laughs> 
Well, I wonder how the title of this vlog is going to be. Like, stopping by doing Cabell's twice or just by, I don't know, probably. It's not going to be that. All right. Well, good luck whatever it is you're doing. Yeah. I'll be right back. So, Lock the door. Try and make it quick. It's get, get hungry now. <laughs> yeah, seriously, guys. I'm starting to get a bit hungry. But anyways. 25 minutes. Okay. Now, this isn't the first time. This isn't the first time I've done one of these vlogs in one take that have been that long but if you if you guys remember the vlog i did which was okay link in the description the vlogs in the link to that vlogs in the description as well good god but the vlog that i did and with little blue we did uh we we looked around at dick's we also looked around at best buy then we went to mcdonald's that vlog was 57 minutes and 30, yeah, 37 seconds long. And again, and has and link to that vlog's in the description if you want to go check that out. But that was the first vlog I did that was that long. I mean, the vlog I did, which was uh Transar Beatery and Orchestra, which we went to go see, that vlog, when I when that that vlog came out to be 25 minutes actually. And now this vlog's 26 minutes. Pretty much when we, by the time we get to McDonald's and I end off the vlog, it's going to be somewhere to 30 minutes or something, you know, that kind of thing. But, uh, yeah. Oh, well. <clears throat> but again, links it links to, uh, 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 yeah, links to the last vlog, Tricon, link to... The vlog of uh, of us doing s the mall, Sky Zone, and doing Cabela's one day later, and the link to the vlog of us seeing Trans Siberian Orchestra. Yeah, links to those links to those vlogs are in the description as well, as well as the Cad Bane fan film that I did. Reason I bring that up is because. Uh, with, because of the Spider-Man costume I was talking about, I'm going to be doing a fan... That's what the... Because if you guys remember, because I mentioned, because I'll be doing a Spider-Man fan film, that's what it's going to be. That's what it's going to be. Just like with the Cad Bane fan film. Doing a Spider-Man fan film in costume. And it will be coming out sometime around the time after... Yeah, pretty much after Spider-Man Far From Home comes out. And literally, Far From Home is going to be coming out, like, literally the first week in... First few days of July, which that you know just uh. Anyways, so so waiting on little blue. I'm doing my best to keep you guys entertained and trying to say some stuff. <laughs> that I'm serious. Well, by the way, check out the shirt I'm wearing. Remember, remember that shirt. Remember that shirt from that vlog I did of us seeing a ven. Well, it was the vlog how. Link to that's in the description as well. Good lord, how, how many more times am I going to keep this up? By mentioning vlogs, I'm mentioning the link in the description. Uh. Anyway, so that vlog I did, um, it was it was actually a few days earlier. It starts off a few days earlier with me, Little Blue, and a good friend of ours named Morgan. We went to, uh, we were actually at Best Buy, then we went to Target, and we actually went for the drive through McDonald's. And then a few days later, cut to a few days later, and me and Little Blue, we, we go see Avengers Endgame. And then we actually go down to Gotti's Pizza alongside with IG Illusional. So if you want to see that, link's in the description as well. Link to that vlog's in the description as well. Like, I need to stop talking about all of the vlogs I've done, you know. I'm starting to get a little tiring of doing that. But anyways. Checking to see if Little Blue, where he is. I might eventually have to go back in to just to go check on him or something. Just wondering what's taking him so long. Eh, but anyways. Oh, I'm trying to fix something there. Ah, uh, but anyways. And, and not only, oh yeah, and I feel like mentioning this, because I didn't mention this in the, la in the last vlog I did, uh, because um, ran into, because... At Tricon, I ran into a good fr a friend of mine, and actually a friend of uh, who's also a friend of one of my other good friends, uh, the Eighth Official, uh, which 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 I ran into. Who I ran into was Boop Noodle. Um, he was dressed up as a uh, stormtrooper, and I 
I think it was his brother, it was a friend of his, who dressed up as a Mandalorian. And obviously, the Mandalorian he was dressed up as was for the Mandalorian, for the Mandalorian series coming to Disney+. Plus. And I was saying to him, like, oh, we were both, like, I was saying, oh, man, really excited for that. And he was, too, like, both excited for The Mandalorian. Aren't you guys excited for The Mandalorian that's coming to Disney Plus? You let me know, because I definitely am. I definitely am. And as I mentioned, as I, as, as I, because I remember I was talking about The Mandalorian on, in the vlog I did of us at Dick's, Best Buy, McDonald's, as I was talking about The Mandalorian. And I was saying, with the, with that show being in the works of both John Favreau and Dave Filoni, two mad geniuses, as I like to call them, um, but yeah, and also, and actually, in the thumbnail of the of the last vlog I did at Tricon, you will you can see because you see a picture of me as dressed up as Cad Bane along with the storm a stormtrooper and the Mandalorian. That's Boop Noodle, and I want to say his either his brother or a friend of his. That's them in costume. Boop Noodle and Boop Noodle is the stormtrooper, and his and I'm gonna say. Boop Noodle's Stormtrooper helmet looks so good, so darn realistic. It looks, it looked like a realistic Stormtrooper. I mean, like a prop replica or something like that of Stormtrooper, you know, that type of uh, Stormtrooper helmet, but, you know. And uh, what's his face? Like, he was dressed up as an Mandalorian. His costume looked pretty cool, and even his helmet. Just so good. And not only that, but Boop Noodle finally got to meet... Little Blue and IG Illusional, because I talked about them before. I've talked to them before, to both to him and 8th Official. Boop Noodle had finally got to meet them. 8th Official, not yet. I soon plan for, for him to meet them. And maybe hopefully I maybe hopefully I, the 8th the Official can join us sometime when we're doing something. Who knows? But um, anyways, so 31 minutes. Okay, now it's 32 minutes. Good even. Okay, seriously, what's taking him so long? What's taking Little Blue so long? I don't want to keep dragging this vlog. I mean, my God. I swear, I think I'm going to have to go back in there and go get him. I'm just saying. Cause I don't want to keep this vlog. I don't want to keep this vlog dragging, you know? I hope you guys are enjoying this, because I'm doing the best I can to keep this going. And up, up till we get to McDonald's. And plus, I am hungry, so... That's not... That's not cool. I'm just... I'm watching him. Wait a minute. There he comes. He, there he comes. He was talking to someone. He was talking to an employee. Here he comes now. Okay, don't have to get out of the car. Don't have to get out of the car now. He's on his way. We're good. By the way, look at some of the boats down there. There you guys can see, like, there's green, there's purple. There's black and a bluish kind of color, I want to say. I don't know. Here he comes. Here comes little blue. Okay, he was looking at us. Oh, wait a minute. I locked the car. If you saw me, I was pointing the camera at you. <laughs> yeah, I saw you. Yes. Now we're on our way down. Now we're on our way. Because I'm, I'm telling you, I'm hungry now, so you know, I'm hungry. Yeah, I am too. What about you? I'm pretty hungry. Okay. Well, anyways, Todd was talking more about, I was doing the best I could to entertain, to keep this vlog going, and also talking more about a uh, Tricon, so. Yeah. Yes. And I mentioned, because I mentioned, you got to meet uh, one of our one of our followers on YouTube, which was Boop Noodle. You got to meet him, finally. Meet who? Boop Noodle, that's his name. He was in the Stormtrooper costume. Boop Noodle. That's his YouTuber name. Okay, Boop yeah. Noodle. Yeah, you got to, he was, remember he was in the Stormtrooper costume. Yep. Yeah, and IG Illusional got to meet him as well, because I've, I've been wanting you guys, I've been wanting you two to meet some of my other friends who are also YouTubers, you know? Mm -hmm. And you got to meet one of them, so. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Home Depot's down there. Maybe we can do, maybe I'd do a vlog about sometime. Uh, well, I'm just saying, it could bound to happen. Corvette. Corvette. Oh, yeah, that's it's awesome. It's a new, new model. And that's the Mexican restaurant, isn't it? No. Uh, just passed by? That is, yeah. 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 And I've that, been there. It's good. And there's Red Lobster. Yeah, Red Lobster's good. The food in Red Lobster, it's pretty good. I mean, yeah, been, if you get the right thing. We've been there before, so. Mm -hmm. Of course, Olive, Olive Garden's Olive there Garden's as well. excellent. Yeah. Three restaurants next door to each other, you know? Well, and you've got that uh, Japanese restaurant back there too, which is ah, also good. Yeah. 
just ate there a couple of weeks ago. Oh, did you? Yes. It was yes. Good. It was very good. Yes. There's McDonald's down there. It's just a few blocks away. That's weird because, you know, because with like, say, three or four restaurants next door to each other and such, is that a way? I mean, that's there. That's Is there a reasoning for that or is that because like to get more of like more for those restaurants to be there for more people to come in to eat? Uh, I mean, it just gives people more choice, you know? That is true. That is true. Well, anyways, so Nick, we're getting close to McDonald's. So right around, uh, so once we get inside and once we start eating, I will end the I will end the vlog off there, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Hmm. I wish I had some money to give them, but I don't. Yeah, that's kind of uh, a bit upsetting, a bit sad there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, but they have food. McDonald. They have food from McDonald's. They do. They do. Yeah. In fact, they I didn't want to. I wasn't going to show that to you guys because for his privacy. So yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I mean, at least mentioning it doesn't hurt. But you know, no, it doesn't hurt. But just, yeah, but know. again, I didn't. I mean, I I wasn't going to show it off due to cer due to circumstances and such. But you know, yeah, don't put them on camera. No. So yeah. See, even I knew. So, anyways, so now we're here at McDonald's. Uh, and I gotta say, this McDonald's is a nice one, you know. It is. We, yes. We should go in. We should drive through, but. But I had the idea. I had in mind of going inside. Well, we're gonna have limited time because it's. Uh, okay. Uh, well, if we go in now, so if we go in now, so you know, and yet literally Taco Bell's right in front of us, as even as we park there, that's crazy. So. And the drive-through. So, anyways. I will go ahead and unplug. All right, now let's make our way in. Wow, 37, yeah, it's 37 minutes now. <laughs> hey, I've done that kind of thing. I've, I've done that kind of vlog before I did, because remember I did I did that vlog where we went to, remember, because we did Dick's, we did Best Buy, and we did this McDonald's, and it came out 57 minutes, 37 seconds long. Well, do me a favor. Well, see, because, and that's, I've done those kind of, kind of vlogs before, so. Well, do me a favor, get a, uh, Yes. Get a place. I will, I will get a place. Get a I most certainly, I most certainly will. And thus, I found a spot right here, so. Oh, anyways. So with that being said, guys, oh, I got, I got Toy Story 4. Well, let's check out those Happy Mail toys. Why don't we? Did you know this one? They're starting to do, they did toy, they're starting to do Toy Story 4. Oh, very cool. Yeah. Very cool. So I gotta show these off. Let's see. Let's see which ones they, uh, okay. So it's these kind of ones right here. There's Bo Peep, there's Buzz Lightyear, there's Woody, there's, what's her face? Uh, I forget her name. One with Rex and Trixie? I don't... I have no idea how that works. One with Forky, Duke Kaboom, the OGMs, and Jesse. Oh, wow. Look at that. Walt Disney World. Win a family vacation to Walt Disney World. Hmm. That's cool. Toy Story 4? Possibly the thumbnail? I don't know. Pointing at Woody. What do you think you I was... hear who's playing? No. Rush. Rush is playing? Yeah. Which song is it? It's um, um, Closer to the Heart. Ah, Closer to the Heart. Okay, gotcha. Well, hey, go ahead and say goodbye because I'm about to end off the vlog. What? Go ahead and say goodbye because I'm about to end off the vlog. He's out. You, you normally say off out. I've gotten so used to you saying that. Yeah, off out. All right. Well, there you go. Okay. So that's Little Blue. So there's Little Blue. So yeah, as as I just said, I'm going to go ahead and end off the vlog. I think we pretty much covered everything. And here's a quick look at the play section that I still believe is, you know, thinking to wilderness. That's basically what it's themed to. But anyways, yeah, I hear Getty Lee singing right now. But anyways, with that said, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Um, yeah, one take of us at Cabela's and here at McDonald's. So with that being said, guys, with that said, again, 
Hope you enjoyed this this vlog in one take, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah, you're not even listening. Okay, take care and peace out.